In this video, I'll show you how to create assignments for your students using the Practice Space Teacher app. You can use it on iOS and Android devices. First, click the second tab at the bottom to get to the list of your students. Then click the student that you would like to create assignments for. I'll click my sample student. And then here I have a list of all the lessons, which is a collection of assignments that I've ever created for the student. So to create a new one, click plus, and then you can create one from scratch. That's with no assignments and just you can totally start fresh or you can copy the last lesson. Since a lot of students use similar material from week to week, a lot of teachers copy use copy the last lesson so i'll go ahead and click that here i have a list of all the pieces or technique or theory items the student is supposed to practice to remove an item i can swipe to the left and then click remove if i would like to reorder the items i can move them up and down by clicking on the four lines to the right and then moving the, the item up or down in the order. To edit it, I would click on it, and then I can change these um, by just typing in the box. So if you want to change what the student needs to work on, or you can change the attachments that you have to that assignment. So if you click plus, you can insert a link to YouTube or what have you. If you click image and video, you'll be taken to your camera reel in case you have a video that you've already recorded on your phone. Um, to click, if you click audio, it would you'd be able to insert any MP3s or audio files you have on your phone. Document, you would be able to attach any PDFs. Camera, you could just create a quick video there on the spot for the student. Or if you click from library, you'll be taken to a list of all the attachments that you've ever used in the past, and you can attach that there for the student. Um, th then when you click save, that will be updated. Um, so here's what a link would look like. They'd, that's, they'd get taken to YouTube there. Um, I also have an example here of what a PDF would look like, um, and they can always click that, um, the teacher or the student, and up upper right hand corner to share it or print it out if they'd like um, and then if you would like to create a new assignment for the student you click plus and then you can create a new assignment from scratch so I will go demo uh, version 2 this is my second time around and then I would you know put in practice this and then I would uh, usually add the attachments um, so I'll just go for my library and I'll just click this exercise that I use. And then if I click save to library, then I can use this time and time again with a different student. So I'll click save. And then here we have demo version two. I'll delete some of these. Um, and then when I click publish, that is sent to the student app. I hope this was helpful.